It's great to see a school that's accessible to all faiths while striving to uphold a greater good. Now, before you can become a law student, you need to position yourself with the best education possible. We set out to answer the question, how can you select the best prep school for you? St. Paul Preparatory School has been strengthening the minds of students since September 2003, when it began with 24 from 10 different countries. The school was created for the purpose of bringing students together from around the globe for a unique and challenging American educational experience. As a true leader for preparatory schools, we decided to ask them, what advantages do parents have by sending their children to a prep school? I think the students have more focus at a prep school. Um, I think the students come with an idea of what it's all about. So they're a little more serious about the academics and about the learning. Uh, sometimes you don't find that with all the students at a, at a public school. One of the most interesting aspects of the school is their international involvement. The school is set up to provide American students an opportunity to study abroad at sister schools throughout the world, as well as international students being able to come here through a host program. If you're an American student in our school in China, but during the summer you want to study French, we have a program in France. Mm. Most schools don't have that kind of opportunity. If you want to study Russian, we have a program in Russia that you can go to. We'll find, we'll find space for you. If you want to uh, study Japanese, same thing. Host family is um, actually can be made up of a variety of different people. We have uh, intact families with children, uh, some young children, and they're people who have decided they want to open up their home to these international students to learn about their culture to provide them an experience while they're here in the United States and hopefully understand a little bit more about what it means to live in a host family in the United States. By hosting, when you share day-to-day -to -day life with someone, you learn something which is important to me, it's the, the power of words. What I like about it is that there are kids here from, you know, you have Russia, Dominican Republic, or Ecuador, Colombia, everywhere but we all do share certain things. We all came here, we all have something in common, and they're really people we can connect with. Having 25 different countries from all over the world really helped me a lot to understand the country, to understand the, the culture, geographical place of the, uh, of the country, uh, the culture, the experiences, how people interact with, the, with each other in that country. That was one of the biggest advantages for me, even for my college experiences here. Um, uh, I'm, plan I'm planning to get more involved in St. Thomas next year and be um, an international mentor, uh, which is going to deal with international students. And I already have experience doing this from my high school. What a way to work towards the road ahead, not only learning your coursework, but the different cultures of your fellow classmates. If you, however, have a son or daughter who struggles with addiction, there is hope for them to have a bright future. That brings us to our next question. How can you help the troubled teen in your life? 